Morning guys, I hope you can see and hear this. I'm just going to share this live with a couple of groups. Give me a moment or two. Please shout out if you can hear and um, see, okay? Just wait a moment or two for people to find the uh, live. So just waiting a moment or two, and then we'll get going. Happy Easter. <laughs> Happy Easter. Resurrection. Uh, rebirth. Renewal. Yeah. Hey, Raul. So good morning, it's uh, 8 a.m. ish here in uh, East Coast Australia. Welcome, welcome, wherever you are. Please tag, uh, share people uh, this this uh, activation, um, whether it's now or post the session. Um, I will endeavor to get this up on YouTube later today, so keep an eye for that and please, um, please, uh, Pass it around to your networks if you feel that it's supportive for people. So really, this came uh, in as a transmission to do for Easter uh, Sunday, um, working with the uh, Andromedan dragons or the Andromedan uh, pink dragon frequency, and also working with the energy of Ascended Master um, uh, Mary Magdalene, uh, which I feel for some reason, whether it's daring to say out loud, is uh, an Andromedan energy, a galactic frequency, and she's coming in today also with these Andromedan dragon energies for for the heart of the collective, for your heart in particular, for um, really an energetic shift, bringing in new information, a coming together of heaven on earth, um, a light initiation. So this is all about anchoring further light into your body, reclaiming your aspect from Andromeda, if you feel like you have an energy that has been linked to Andromeda in the past. Now, I was talking with um, uh, Carrie and Chris yesterday on the uh, Light Worker Lounge, I think it is called. Uh, we did an interview, it's it's below in my um, wall, and we were talking about the, the characteristics of the Andromeda star seeds, uh, which is a very pure um, childlike innocence of energy, very heart centered, uh, very um, linked with the Hathors. Um, Dendura is their temple in Egypt. So we may do a little bit of a guided piece to Dendura here today. And this is also about, um, you know, that vulnerability, that, that innocence that is sometimes um, uh, a bit of naivete in regards to being trampled on by other people. So this is also around self-worth and self-acknowledgement and finding your true path. So this is an activation of finding your true path. So I'm going to work with a few different uh, crystal pieces, uh, mainly rose quartz uh, because it is the pink heart of Andromeda that we're working with. Uh, so this is a very deep heart activation today. So I'm glad that you're joining me this Easter Sunday here at, live in Australia. Please, if it's, it's somewhere else in the world, hopefully uh, you'll be in the energy uh, on your Easter too. Yeah. <clears throat> so firstly, I want to work with this uh, lotus, um, rose lotus. 
yeah, Rose Lotus. And this is for the heart space itself, yeah? And this is for the heart uh, space uh, itself. Uh, hello, Evie. Uh, welcome. Welcome from uh, Sydney, uh, Sydney, from the Sunshine Coast, uh, Queensland, to, to you in Sweden, yeah? So this is uh, for the... the uh, for the heart chakra and this is uh, a depth andromeda frequency from the portal of the galaxy andromeda to your heart chakra so this is an activation of your heart chakra to the their frequencies to the innocence to the truth to the integrity of andromeda that is wishing to come through this day as a renewal accessible energy to open the heart further into joy to into love into bliss and into your uh, soul essence, yes, your soul essence, okay? Ashke puta tata taka puta tana naka parka shike le peke puta tana naka parka puta tana naka shile puta ke puto 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 shile peke te ke puto 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 tana tana naka shala parka puto 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 tere parka tana naka like the petals of the lotus opening in the morning sunlight. You are birthing, you are emerging from the darkness of your own dark night of the soul, the collective of Earth. We, the Andromedan Dragons, are here to support you, advancing now into further accelerated frequencies of your heart chakra. As we bring through these key codes of light in this divine transmission on this your Easter Sunday in your earthly realm, we are bringing through the light that will open your heart to further self-acceptance, to further uh, acceptance of difference and an acceptance of change. We know that so much is unraveling, revealing, disclosing and opening on your planet at this time, both above and below. There is much uh, confusion and chaos. We sit with you in your heart chakra and offer you the peace and love of Andromeda. The divine expression on your earthly plane would be your Hathor frequencies from the days of Egypt and the mystery schools. We are here today to offer you great love, great compassion, great courage in your changing process of humanity. It is a struggle for many with the energies at this time, the solar light activating key codes within the heart and the energetic body, uh, agitating the nervous systems to release what is ready to release, to open to what ready is to open. Know that you are on track, know that you are on path, know that you are gaining clarity and truth day by day. And this is as it should be. So I'm just going to keep working through. If there's any comments on what you're feeling, uh, anything you want to ask about in particular today, ask away. It is your Easter Sunday too, so I felt like it, it could be a bit of a co-creation event. So please uh, feel free to share what's happening. And if, if I feel like I can, I'll include some of it in, in today's transmission. <clears throat> so let's now work with the rose. Let's now work with this rose. Uh, I feel like this energy, again for the heart space, my dear ones, again for the heart space. This is from Mary Magdalene, Mary Magdalene, okay? So let, let this energy filter into your heart, filter into your th third eye, filter into your throat, fil filter into your high heart. As it comes through as a pink stream of consciousness from her to you, her, her, her galactic self to you, I would say. <clears throat> She badana na ke budu du 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 de ke badana na na ka shala budu du de badana na na ka budu du da da na na ka she le be de ke budu du du na 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 ka budana na na kur ke badana na ka she le be de ke budu du de ke budu du na 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 ka da da na 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 ka she le be de ke budu du 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 na na ka pro ka badana na na ka she le be de ke budu du du no 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 du 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 no no ka du du no no ka du du no no ki she le badana na na ka o chu chu she le budu du de ka pro ka badana na na ka she le be de gudu du 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 ganat kar ka par ka par ka ba da 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 she le be de gudu du gosh ke ba da da na 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 shala bu ka da na na ka bur ka na 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 bu ka da na na ka she le be de ke 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 ti 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 ti
Take a breath. Take a breath. So I would say I am the energy you, you would have known as Mary Magdalene back in the uh, days of Christ. I'm here to offer you my love today and also offer you the courage to be different, to hold faith in your uniqueness and your path. For it was when I was cast out on the day of the crucifixion that I had to go into hiding and I went to the south of France and I built my church and my temple and I practiced it dil diligently. I offer you the the. Uh, the sanctity of diligent practice, of diligent heart practice and devotion to yourself, to love and to the divine. With so much changing in your worldly realm, you must remember to hold your heart with grace and ease. For you to practice the nourishing practices that allow your body to grow, to expand, to germinate and flourish in this changing world. I am, an I am an example of the divine feminine uh, with f that was never uh, forgiving of, uh, of others that crossed her until she forgave herself. So it is now that we are asking for divine forgiveness of self through the ages, through the ancients, so that we may be reborn and released from the cages of our own hearts and the past life trauma that we carry in our souls. For we have always done the best that we can, and the light of Christ has always been by our side. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. Amen. So let me just change crystal. <laughs> let me just change crystal. Take a moment, take a breath. Have a drink of water if you wish. <clears throat> blessings, Jeannie, blessings. Hello, Sonia. Hello. So this piece, hey, this is a shocker. <laughs> this is a beautiful piece that just came in Friday. Um, and he's, um, I think he's a he, even though he's a little um, pink in colour. <laughs> yeah, and he's going to continue with this forgiveness piece, yeah. A beautiful, powerful rose quartz um, uh, Andromedan dragon, yeah, Andromedan dragon, yeah. <clears throat> and he's coming in today to really empower the heart to forgive because it takes a certain level of trust, it takes a certain level of uh, personal um, resilience really to be able to let go of the pain of the past and and that that we identify with and that that keeps us trapped and that that keeps us in uh, limiting um, patterns and beliefs so we now work with the Andromeda Drangas bringing in courage releasing the pain of um, wounds really the pains of wounds and this may be related to energies from the christ timeline to uh the teachings of christ to the uh crucifixion of christ if you were energetically um uh have an experience in that lifetime <clears throat> so we're just releasing uh really wounds from the persecution complex the um the the the, the deep wounds of uh, the star seeds and the light workers, really, that have had so many different lifetimes uh, and birthings in spiritual contexts where they have been persecuted for their beliefs. I know this is a theme that we've covered many times, but it we've, it, it sort of um, at this time of the year it is always uh, heightened because of uh, the intensity of the Christ energy. On the planet. So we again have Dushundadiki, an opening, a portal from Andromeda, uh, golden, pink light, to wash away the sins of the past, if you will. Not that we really are sinners or that we were, have sinned, but this is the energy of the old ways of the old order that made us believe that we were shamed and guilt ridden for our spiritual beliefs and the way we um, carried out our lives, whether this life or past, okay? <clears throat> Forgiveness and 
soothing for the heart from the Andromedan dragons. Eshka tuto da na 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 ka shala burki pata na 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 ka shala buta na 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 ka shala burka pata na na ki pata na 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 ka shule beka pap tuto tiki pata tuto tiki tiko tata tarki burki ki 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 burki ki 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 burki ka na na ka shule pati kuto tuto shala buti ko pata na 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 ka shule paka shule paka shule paka shule paka kiki poranda tiki poranda tiki poranda tapa kati ka pote tiki poranda tapa kati ta 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 El Shaba, El Shaba, Orkanda, Daka, Eshikati, Alashika, Badagana, Borgibi, Shalabarka, Badaka, Daddy, Shalabarka, Paka, 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 Pututututaki, Porkotototaki, Porkotototaki, Porkotototaki. It is okay to let go of the beliefs that you are somehow um, inferior, that you are somehow never going to make it, that the planet is never going to make it, the, the energy of hopelessness and sadness. It is okay to feel that now in your hearts. Feel it come, feel it well up and let it go. Feel it come well up and let it go. Feel it come uh, well up and let it go. So just taking a moment, taking a moment. Hmm. Just letting all those energies settle. And we're going to continue working with another dragon now, a smaller, but still powerful Rose Quartz dragon. And this one is a message from the Hathors. And we're going to go into a, a very quick, very simple guided piece right now. And this is going to be a, a star um, activation for the heart uh, within your own heart chakra for Andromeda. This is an initiation. So um, you may like to close your eyes. You may like to keep them open. But whatever you feel is going to help you most, um, I guess, go into yourself and allow this energy to open into your heart space now, okay? So, all you have to do is listen to my words as per usual, okay, be guided by them, let the energies move you, there's no right or wrong, as you hear the light language, let it touch you in whatever way it does, and just absorb what is ready for your soul to absorb, okay? So if you feel safe and comfortable to do so, please close your eyes now. So we are going on a guided journey, my friends, on this, the Easter Sunday of your current year, 2023. And we are going back to a time of beauty and innocence and divine love. It is in the uh, Temple of Initiation in Dendura, Egypt, with the Hathors. Take a giant leap of consciousness through this silver portal of light. Jambari bando dori bandara kara kara shile bede ki 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 burkondoro kondoro 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 ka 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 Find yourself in a beautiful temple the walls are covered with selenite, clear quartz and rose quartz. You're in a sacred ceremony. You're wearing white cloth. You are seated in a circle. In the center of the circle is a giant rose heart crystal. It is the heart of Andromeda and is the heart of divine innocence and purity and love. It is to be initiated into your heart chakra to f take you further and deeper into your heart chakra than you have been previously. It is a returning of the Andromedan heart land to this earthly realm so that we can remember our truth, our integrity, our innocence of beingness before everything was layered on. And that we can come back to this bliss state, peace, consciousness. 
and hold it firmly in our hearts, in our pillars, gifting it to the earth and the people as they rock and roll in the chaos of the birthing of the new. Feel it now radiate out from the centre of the space, this beautiful Andromedan heart, into your own heart chakra now. Shambo de gabarki banana na shala barkando do de ge banana na shala bakana na ka shile be de ge burkondo de ge banana na ka shala barkondo no no ki shile be de ge burkondo de ge begi shile be de ge burkondo de ge begi shulo bukana na kar shile be de kuno no ko shula baki kodo do de banana na kar ki kar ki ka shile be de ge te 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 Shele beti ti 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 Shele beti kukura na karkika na na ka kukurki pete ti ki 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 Feel a deep pink opening in your heart space. Almost magenta in colour. It is filling your whole light body. You have been activated and initiated with the Andromeda heart. You will carry it always, sweet ones. It will seed a new beginning, a rebirth, a resurrection of yourself and your work and your life. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. Amen. <sighs> Take a moment now to jump back through the silver portal in into your current consciousness and space where you began this activation. Gashki burkunde de parki kor 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 ki ganda na kar 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 kar. So take a moment. You have flown into the cosmos. You have worked with your divine light Merkaba, you have transformed from one reality to another and activated your beautiful Andromedan heart. Your Andromedans are singing, are clapping, are cheering that we have connected with this energy today. This is a pivotal moment in the activation of one of many so that the earth can transcend through the consciousness of the collective field, through the star seeds, through the light workers, through the earth workers, through the, the royal initiates that have come back to bring their frequency home to this planet, to arrive, to ground, to be here in truth. And so it is, and so it is, and so it is. They love you, we love you, you are loved. Amen. So just taking a moment. Taking a moment just to come back to yourself. Well, there's maybe a little bit more before we go. I'm drinking kombucha, by the way. It's not beer. <laughs> Even though it is Republic all the time. <laughs> So just feeling that love, that pink, that light, that frequency in your heart space now. I suggest that you just go gently after this energetic, um, energetic uh, transmission and uh, lay on the earth and allow the energies to be filtered through you to the earth. Yeah. So taking a breath, taking a breath. <clears throat> So here, yeah, this is a, some would call it source of life. I think you know what it is. Uh, female parts, yeah. Uh, again, rose pink in colour. Rose pink in colour, yeah. <laughs> That's right, Carrie. <laughs> rose pink in colour, yeah. And this is going to be an activation of your sacred um, heart, uh, sacral centers yeah so that we as and this is uh, working with the uh, feminine frequency the feminine aspect of self whether you are um uh, currently a, a, in a physical male or female body uh, this is uh, really or something in between these days <laughs> who would know but um uh, 
This is about the feminine aspect of your being, your feminine line, your, your mother line, your left side, your right brain, uh, intuition, your creation. So this is about new creation from, and this is bringing in key codes for, for the sacral from Andromeda so that you align up with that matrix from Andromeda and that you can bring through the wisdom a new creation that is wanting to come through from Andromeda for the planet. Yeah. So all you have to do is place a little bit of awareness, maybe on your heart, maybe on your sacral, or if you can do both, let go for that. And we're just going to bring through some more energy. And again, this is from the Andromedan Dragons, wishing to clear the, clear the decks, open to new, uh, uh, birth, birthing the, uh, mm, the resurrection from within of the Christed Ones, of the royal lineages of Andromeda, coming in now, being birthed, been anchored in your physical to be uh, mm, to be, to walk the lands and spread the light. Yes. She put the data capata and capor capoto da da capor camata da capota nana capota da naka. She le pete kipota nana naka. And this is also dissolving any wounds around the mystery schools, around distortions in Egypt. And coming back to the purity of the Hathors and Dendura. Uh, releasing the sexual misery programs, the sexual slavery, and the sexual um, hybridization. It's from the sacral now. It is safe. It is safe to receive. It is safe to receive from source. It is safe to open and receive the light of Christ. It is safe to have pleasure in the physical form. It is safe to feel abundance in energy, in material life. You are safe to expand now, sweet ones. You are safe to embody your truth. You are safe to grow, to move out of the old and try new things. You are safe. We love you. We are the Andromedan dragons and we hold courage and love for humanity at this time of the deepest transformation. And so it is. And so it is. And so it is. Amen. So there's one less piece for today. One less piece for today. <clears throat> yeah, and this one, yeah, this one is gorgeous. This one is a blue rose quartz, blue rose quartz dragon. And he's coming in to finish off the activation uh, just to balance now. It's um, a divine love, divine love again, once again, but this time. This time, this one is uh, the balancing with the masculine heart, the masculine heart. So he's is still an Andromedan dragon, but this one is true uh, unconditional love for your masculine aspect, yes? Because there's, there, it's now also time for the masculine aspect to rise, for them to take their rightful places in leadership, in sacred work, in the sacred heart, of the masculine. So this is a sacred heart of the masculine. Um, and I would say we were working with the energy of the Andromedan dragons once again, but we're also working with the energy of uh, Jeshua, yes? As a completion, an activation of your Christed masculine heart, which is going to almost uh, invite a, um, a golden activation around your heart chakra that will help your heart chakra to 
uh, expand exponentially, to feel nurtured, and to feel uh, uh, um, secure in your physical form that you may step into new ways, especially uh, with your masculine aspect, okay? Masculine aspect. So just to allow this energy now to come through and uh, uh, focus on your heart space a little, okay? <clears throat> And just as uh, uh, Jeshua uh, died and re re was reborn as an energetic DNA example within our collective field of ascension, we are too ascending now in our energies, in this rebirthing, in this renewal, in this activated time of transition for Gaia. So allow this energy now to come into your hearts, bringing in fresh air like a breath, a breeze of light, of golden consciousness with pink sparkles of light. She put the Kibarka Badana Kabarka Banana Kabarka Nana Kabotana Kabadana Kabarkana Naka. She put the Kapatana Nana Kapotana Nana Kapotana Nana Karaka Barkana Kapata. She betiki putana Nana Kapotana Nana Kapata da 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 Kabarkano to do the Kanaka. Shulopata Katwutu Nana Kapurkama to the Kiputana Kashuka Tata to take a Barkana Naka. She le petiki banana na kaputa na 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 kaprka na 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 ka. She le petiki 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 pota na 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 ka. Sholo 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 pika ta na na kuto ta ka na na kaputa na na. She le petiki. She le petiki. She le petiki pota na 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 ka pa ka pa ka pa ka pa ka pa ka pa ka. And a message from Joshua. He said there were many times where I lost faith and hope in humanity and in the in the, the innate goodness of people. I would weep. It was not documented, but I would weep many times over at the state of the collective mind and the the torture and the pain uh, that uh, that people went through both internally but also uh, perpetuated onto each other through their projections and their past life trauma. But I hereby give you the gift of the pure heart of the masculine to never give up, to hold firm in the divine and your connection to source. That even though days come where you feel unsettled and knocked off center and you hope and you lose hope and faith in all that is. This is a natural part of the process of devolution to create a revolution in your planetary consciousness. I and many star seeds, galactics from many realms, ascended energies, angelics, inner earth beings are very grateful at this time for your service for your continued evolution, for wading through the shadow and the bogs and the, and the, the dirt and the under earth of the collective field of your own shadow so that you may be freed and your ancestors to come may be freed into the space of the new earth. You are showered with so many blessings today, dear hearts many blessings you are deeply loved please do not forget that and so it is and so it is and so it is amen so just take a moment take a breath As always, remembering to anchor ground these energies to what is right for you as a body after we complete this session. Please pass this uh, video on. Please tag people if you wish, if you feel drawn. I will try and get it on YouTube later today. If you wish to connect with any of the crystals I've worked with today, please just send me a private message. Um, I'm hoping to get out a, uh, a solar eclipse online group, if not in person, in the Sunshine Coast around the 20th. I will be back in Sydney 
for a face-to-face group at the 5th of the 5th of the 5th. That's going to be a powerful one, a two-hour group in Sydney. Uh, that's a Friday evening, 6.15 to 8.15. I've got some of you down on the list already. Please shout out if that's you and you wish to attend. Yeah. Um, and of course, the, the, the private sessions are available. You can just PM me um, for that too. So thank you from the bottom of my heart for tuning in, for co-creating this energetic space, for your, not only for yourselves, not only for your own work, but for the collective field and for the em, solar embodiment, for the solar, solar embodiment of your light body and your royal lineage light body. This is the time to not feel shy of your ancestry, to not feel shy of who you are and what you are becoming because the earth and the energy fields need you now to step up, yeah? And really, um, you know, we are doing the soul embodiment in the physical form. It's a very physical process. So honor that and allow yourself to rest if you need to, to move if you need to, to nourish in different ways if you need to. Um, to reach out to each other in community if you need to, uh, to get uh, body work, uh, massage, uh, any kind of stretching stuff, yeah, if you need to. This is, the solar light has been so powerful lately, so, so powerful. It has uh, disrupted people's energy fields in a good way, I feel, at times, because it's, it's allowing us to amplify. But, you know, working with um, Shungite is always useful. Uh, for your energy body, for your light body. If you're feeling nervous system is a bit fried, a little bit whacked out, um, working with shungite, black tourmaline is, um, is always useful because it helps settle the nervous system. Um, so grab yourself some of that, yeah. And I just really want to say thank you for, for being part of this uh, transmission today, being part of this tribe, being part of this group, this work. Uh, and calling in your higher self and calling in your higher gifts at this time for for doing the deep work and humanity's sake. Um, we are very blessed, I feel, as a community and we are held in high esteem for the work that we are doing. So carry on troops, <laughs> carry on troops and much love to you all and um, have a beautiful day wherever you are in the world. Bye for now. <laughs>